Colon cancer is the third most common form of cancer in the U.S. That's according to Sally F. Teha, a colon and rectal surgeon at Piedmont Macon Medical. There's probably going to be over 100,000 new cases of colorectal cancer that will be diagnosed uh, this year. So it's pretty prevalent. F. Teha says colorectal cancer is an invasive disease where cells in the colon or rectum grow out of control. He says one of the best ways to protect against colon cancer is to have a colonoscopy. There's been an increase in younger folks getting this form of cancer and diet plays a huge role, especially the prevalence of processed foods and obesity. Because of this, the screening age is now 45. Typically, it affected people in their 50s, 60s and 70s. Wydrate Nelson got diagnosed with colon cancer at the age of 43. In June of 2021, six months after his diagnosis, he went to stage zero. A full year after his diagnosis, the cancer went back to stage four. Nelson says colon cancer is preventable. A lot of people will hear stage four, they immediately think it's a death sentence. But to me, it was a life sentence because now I made the lifestyle adjustments that are going to help keep me here versus keeping the lifestyle that would have took me out earlier. Nelson hopes to be cancer-free and one day become a 50-year cancer survivor.